So topic two is to understand what we mean by packaging. Packaging is the technology of enclosing or protecting the products for distribution, storage, sale and usage. It can be described as a coordinated system of preparing goods for transport, warehousing, logistics, sale and end use. Having said that, let's understand what are the key qualities for good packaging. Well, first, it definitely has to have an attractive appearance so as to pull the customers towards it. Second, it should be very convenient for storage and display. Third, it should shield against damage or spoiling or any kind of adulteration. Next, product description should be clearly shown on the package. It helps in increasing sales. Good graphics and attractive color will make the product appealing. Also, it adds to the use of a product. It helps to promote a product, contributes to the safety of product, helps in storage and helps in product differentiation. Finally, functions of packaging, especially for consumer goods. Protection and presentation are the basic functions of any packaging. A packaging should ensure that our products do not get adulterated or damaged while storing or before usage. And also the presentation should be attractive enough to attract the customers towards it in relation to the other brand products available. Second, modern marketing methods demand that package should be convenient to handle the transport requirements. Next, a package must be made to consistent and rigid quality standards. That is, it should have some kind of uniformity over a period of time. Next, the consumer demands uniformity each time he purchases a product in terms of quality, the contents of the item and etc. Every package must be recognizable and must have an eye appeal. Also, it should be easy to dispose of, should be easy to identify and should be adequately marketed.